Here's a scenario called The Great Hall by the same author as Kasnar, which was a real good time. So let's see what's in store for us here. The adventure begins! Alright. I don't like you. Aw. <laughs> this is a 15-15, by the way. That ogre also doesn't like me. Okay, what about this one? Nope. Was that a, a randomly spawned bat on spawn into this? I guess it might have been. All right, the sea on an island. I, uh, there was another boat there. Find the crown, scepter, shield, necklace, and king. All right, five goal objects here. <laughs> uh, Muller here, hey, I have a lot of level ups queued up. Help me out. So yeah, I'm finding that there are more, um, more people who have made multiple scenarios than I thought at the start of this project, but yeah, turns out a whole bunch uh, did it. So yeah, we get to follow multiple different authors through their, their journey learning how to make adventures in this game. Sea is still full of snakes. The read me here for this didn't give me any hints about which of the two came first. Uh, so I just do not know. Black Phantom, Wyverns, you'll die if you enter. Yeah, all right, yeah. Uh, I'm up for dying. Also, it's a 15-15, so I'll be fine. Uh, a C. Just one. Alright, yeah, let's go this way. Death awaits below. Alright, he will die if you enter. Is the way to it here? Hmm. Yes. Okay. So, uh, give me a moment. Let me check the surface first. Okay, so death awaits below there. Uh, although I could do that before I get too invested in, uh, exploring stuff. Maybe I will. How far have I gone? Oop. Not very. You know what? Let's do that, actually. I'm gonna go down now. Just because I pretty much know my way around these few screens that I've seen, and screen transitioning is fine right now. An underground sea! Thanks for the spell points. Now let's fight. So no healing items given to me yet. Traps. Trap difficulty 15. The underground sea! <laughs> Another sea! <laughs> Right. It looks a lot like the Overground Sea. Very similar. This is definitely a distinctive style that this author has. Aren't we having fun? You woke me! Ah, oh, sorry. <laughs> I woke up all the bats. They all have the same thing to say. These bats can talk. Other bats I've encountered could not. All right, so this room's a little too suspicious for me to walk out of it without checking the walls. That won't take long, it's just... Okay, yeah, see? Suspicion! The readme also told me to search everywhere and cast a heal spell often. That might mean there aren't a lot of fountains. I mean, yeah, there, there aren't. There have been zero so far. A pirate's hidden chamber. No, a pirate's hidden chamber. <laughs> Alright. Well, this is money, but is is it just money? Ah, uh, we're doing this again. Alright, there we go. Commands buffered. Um, I'm gonna assume that there's nothing else through these walls. I say that as I test them. I'm gonna assume that I'll find nothing, but I'm still testing it anyway. Alright, I found nothing. There better be a huge money monger gauntlet here. <laughs> there's not going to be a huge money monger gauntlet. There never is. Every once in a while, there have been a couple of times that I have run into money mongers and needed to go hunt down treasure for them. Oh, well, there's, uh... Okay. Okay. I figured there had to be something else here. There's nothing else here. 
Is there something else here? Oh boy. What are you doing? That annoying little jut of land means I have to leave my boat. So just for treasure, huh? I mean, all right. This is just too suspicious. I, I really feel the need to check. Nothing. So, hold up. Did I go down here? Yes, that's where the treasure was. Yes, okay. Well, all right then. Underground sea. Just a place to explore. All right. Cool. What else can I find? Death awaits below. There were just some, like, bats and skeletons and not much else. Uh, I was expecting to get in there. Okay, sure, so there's access to that. All right, so let's find a way either there or... Um, yeah, this is a hidden passage. Mm-hmm, called it. It was just a little too out of place for the surrounding tiles. Search the walls, there are hidden passageways. There sure are. Uh-huh. Do you like me? Eh, has no opinion. How about you? Has no opinion. All right. These ogres are less unfriendly than the other ones. How about the spider? Spider doesn't care. All right. The hall. Is it a great one? Kremlin has nothing to say. All right, deeper in the hall. And my stats. Not going to get any more new spells, so any spell point increases... Hey, check it out, a door. Uh, any more spell point increases will just be easier casting and more casting. Sounds good. Not a low spawn rate here. Oh yeah, definitely not. I've stopped being interested in what monsters have to say. This snake has a private little water pit of its own. Even if I wanted to disturb it, I couldn't. And apparently I want to, because I'm really trying. <laughs> I guess I could cast genocide. Let's not. Why would I do such a thing? So yeah, still zero healing items. The hall. Great oars. Hey, fairy. Hey, time to recharge. Well, there goes the fairy. Okay, well, let's uh, do something about this, actually. I want to know what that fairy had to say, and I think this might tell me if she was the first... Uh... Well, that gave me a warlock. I can't use that for talking. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I think this can give me literally any creature. Let's test it out another time or two. If I had entered closer to the phantom... They have my parents. There we go. That's what she said. If I had entered closer to the phantom... Uh, I could have distracted him from killing her, probably. I'll take a permanent resist, sure. And a perma zap. The way I like it. And you know what? If there's going to be this much water around, let's take the convenience of a water walk. That'll be fine. Okay. They have my parents, you say. Can I do something about this? Maybe. They've hidden things everywhere. Who is this they I keep hearing about? Uh, yeah, what was the, with that... Uh, oh, hey. The hall went to drink. <laughs> this room has two titles. 
Hidden places deep underground. Yeah, I found a pirate cave. You both say the same thing. I came from here, right? There's an archer on the screen. Yes. Okay. So I need the gray key to get through there, and you two are going to make that impossible. We might have to fight. All right, unfortunate. Lava pit! All right, I need a way in. I found one. I have perma resist, so this is fine. Plenty comfortable. Two ways up. I will take this one. Oh dear, magic floor, be careful. What's hitting me? Oh right, you can go through those uh, traps. They don't stop shots. Ouch, three, three sides. Wait a second. Okay, no, I can shoot over the... Eee! Oh, I just realized you were standing on a ladder. Good thing you didn't drop any treasure. <laughs> that could have been bad. Uh, let's put a stop to... Yeah, you flew right directly over the, the ladder. Like you knew what you were doing. Well, okay, so it is impossible to remove that force field for two different reasons. Fortunately, there are other zap generators around. And fountains. Oh, the slashing. Is this just... yeah, it is. So there was a way up. If that demon had dropped gold, I had already forgotten there was a way up there, I would have never known. I would have gotten, like, super ridiculously stuck and had no idea what to do. That's a real scary prospect. Okay, I need to really... A Dark Lord's treasure! <laughs> Just some Dark Lord, not any particular one. <laughs> Alright, and my perma resist is gone, so... Getting lava but just for tiny little amounts of damage. That's just not a concern anymore. Yeah, gotta make a careful note of all the... ladders and stairways as soon as I enter a room. I'm picking up money I'll never use. I'm taking a bunch of damage doing it. Blobs have nothing to say. Oh hey, floor type here is tile. Alright, that seems accidental. <laughs> the last one had it as lava. Yeah, there's no way that's on purpose. Probably. Alright, this is fine. I'll, I'll be swinging by a fountain on my way out. Alright, yeah, so a lot of little asides just for treasure. Is it just for treasure? Um, here. I'll avoid spending my life to, uh... Find out if there's more. I think there's probably not. I'm gonna assume I don't have to take down any force fields. Alright, no hidden passages. Fine. Okay, um, so that's this place. Uh, right, the uh, way out is there, and I think there's another one on this side. Uh, I'm so confident I'm gonna walk all the way across the lava to get to it. Yeah, okay, so getting getting an idea of how the uh, hidden passages absorb um, surrounding tiles. I think I have a pretty good grasp on it. It just goes in reading order, doesn't it? If there's something to the upper left, that's what it's gonna take. If there's not, it continues to the north, then the northeast, then the west, then the east. Probably. Okay, so did I have any other ways over here? I have completely forgotten. Um, I might not know for sure because of all the ridiculous amount of hidden passages around here. Okay, so get a gray key, come back here, and there'll be more to do. Okay, let's find a gray key. Where might I go for that? How about north? I haven't been north of the start. Uh, uh. Hey, 
Here's my boat. My buffs did not last. This looks suspicious. Uh-huh. Maybe there's a gray key in here. There's a marble key. I'll take that. That's kind of gray. Not quite the same thing, though. <laughs> what? Why? Is there a hidden passage right here? There is... well, there's one there, but I I could have could have easily bypassed. Uh, right, let's check this. But you know, the... Uh, the... Um, uh, another private snake water pit. Um, the marble door clued me to search there. Just so I don't ever have to come back to this room. I have checked it now. Yeah, it's vaguely possible you could have something leading up there. You don't. Search everywhere. Ah, oh boy. So I have a pretty aggressive schedule for this series, and I'm having a little bit of trouble keeping up with... Uh, uh, how many long scenarios I've been getting lately? I wouldn't mind more like 15 to 20 minute experiences. Doesn't look like that's what I'm getting today. Alright, well there's like... nothing going on here. Okay. Well, I got a marble key, you know, that's actually important. I can check over here. I guess I will. I guess I... That's all the checking I'm going to do. I'm not checking the north edge. Why be so spotty about it? I don't know. Because I feel like it. I don't feel like going to more effort. Thanks. Thanks. We'll not talk. So, what's up here? I've never gone down there, have I? Maybe that's where the gray key is. Make my day, all right? Your day is made. So is the snake's day? Die! See, occasionally they say stuff. It's just too rare to be worth talking to everybody. Sloths, any hidden passageways? Any last words? Nope. Do they all say that? I have to check now. Don't be standing on that ladder. Okay. Any hidden passageways? Yep, there's one. Treasure and a key! There's that gray key. Alright. You have too much endurance. I'm gonna zap you. You didn't die in one. That's what I was hoping you would do. There we go. Okay, so back to the Great Hall for the doors, although I'll look around here to the north first just because I'm here now, and I might as well. I'm not checking for passageways here. Don't feel like it. If I get stuck, I guess that's a place I can come back to. Blue door! I see. <laughs> Bye, says that. There's a wyvern in there. Eat my shorts. What? <laughs> All right then. At least you're not telling me to do what that skeleton in hell told me to do. <laughs> uh, this is silly. What did that bat have to say? Bye. That's right. I talked to it. All right, so I need blue key up there. Blue key north. I have the gray key. I'm going back to the great hall shortly. Onyx key here. Water's edge of mountain pass. Okay. So looking for blue and onyx for the north. Anything I can get to here? Probably not. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Um, this is new. <laughs> die fool. <laughs> that says die fool. Stoneman says die fool. Okay. 
What's down here? Looks pretty familiar. Pirate's Domain. I guess that's what the assassins are. Yeah, nothing's hurting much. Fifteen fifteens are pretty nothing at this point for this character. Thanks. Are you unfriendly? Yes, you are. This is like a throne room or something. Alright, little checkerboard of traps on the room edge. Not elsewhere. Alright. Oh, hi! Hey, I found the king. That's one of five uh, <laughs> winning artifacts. Alright, well, I, uh, I took out the molars. Is that enough help for you? I'll take out the sloths too. Any last words? Die intruder. Alright. This is just for treasure again, isn't it? Probably. Anyway, yeah, so I have a gray key. There's a place I can take it. I hope that's actually progress. What do you want to bet? Not a single money monger in the scenario. It's just nobody who built scenarios with this knew how to use money. It's so weird. It's like so rare that anybody uses it for its intended purpose. All right, I haven't been here yet. New stuff is new stuff. Is this all made of hidden passage? It sure is, that's what I thought. Um, okay, that did seem real suspicious. But it doesn't go. Ah, uh, really, you're gonna do this now, like fake outs? And make sure I've hit every square. I'll do it with my projectile so you can see it. Okay. Fine. Have I been to whatever's south of there? I don't think so. Have I been to whatever's north of here? Doesn't look like it. All right, so that's a little suspicious, but whatever. I have a gray key. Let's use the gray key for gray key things. I go here. Through one of these walls. This one will do. And right, this gets me into this monster lair over here, among other things. All right, boy, you're going to have to move. I'm going to just hold this key until you do. Will it ever happen? Uh, it did, but the girl moved in. I'm going to hold this key. I will not kill this suit. I refuse. Not going to happen. You will eventually wander. It might take a while. <laughs> oh, this is awful. Here, let me um, block the boy's passage and that won't help. Do you have a preferred direction you'd like to wander? Is it because, like, you can shoot, you you will shoot? All right, am I finally actually forced to kill one of my friends? Hold on, I can do a thing here. Check it out. I have a an alternative. Soothe. There is a use for the soothe spell to get somebody to get out of Mortal Kombat sate their bloodlust for a moment so that they'll wander away from a place that's blocking me. Now go away, bat. Yeah. Oh, they got angry at me because I attacked the bat. That's funny. The bat was their friend then because I soothed. <laughs> All right. Let's fight. Go no further. No way, I'm going further. Oh boy, you flanked. Well, kinda. You did a thing that resulted in more of you hitting me at a time. I'm gonna say there are spikes there. I disarmed, but it was not a trap. Oh boy, a sloth room. 
No comment. That damage sound played weird. Oops, I... I... Okay, watch those keys. You can't be doing that in, like, a room with magic floors. How did I manage to hit C when I was aiming for D? That's really weird. Okay. Okay. It had to be something. I was warned twice. All right, force field. On, off. I choose off. I'll get past you, sure. I'll get past all of you. It'll be no problem. Did I one-shot that black phantom? I mighta! Okay. I'm not gonna force field on off just to disarm those traps. Gonna keep going. <laughs> Look for a secret passage. I see food! Okay, see, like, that's a good one. <laughs> I look tasty. Alright, room title, I will. Will I find one, though? As in, is there one to find? Oops, yes, there was, and I did. You are very warm. Especially after fighting five fire demons who just wanted to eat me. <laughs> ah, this is so silly. But that's the fun. I right, play this to see the silliness and other things. I'm very warm. Alright, so this is a heavily trapped spot, and that's where the passage is. Okay. Congratulations, you win! Oh, I, I do. Well, what about all the other doors and stuff? Okay, I'm actually hurting a lot here. Can I cast all heal? I can. I'm gonna. And I don't have enough re left for force field on off. Well, okay, guess I'm making another trip out here. That's fine. I kind of wanted to go other places, too. Because, yeah, I found the goal objects. Yes, what about the blue door? What about the onyx door? Why is this just down here, of all places? I mean, I could take the win. After I go back for some SP. So, yeah, no winning this without at least 80 SP, apparently. Um, okay, so goal objects here. Great. Where is here again? So in the monster's domain. Why was this... Why? Why? What is... What is this? <laughs> no money mongers, by the way. Uh, Alright, so I kind of remember my way there. Alright, I'm gonna look around a little bit more. See if the gray key gets me to a blue key or an onyx one. But okay, at least I know how to end the scenario when I want to. I'm just not ready to yet. So I've been here, right? Yes. Stats up. Okay, yeah, see, like, there are additional adventures down here. Down or to the north? Okay, well, let's keep looking around. These have nothing to say. Author wasn't feeling creative when they placed these monsters. No writing prompts inspired. There's a pointless door. Alright, couple of ways down here. Good to know. See, look how much more scenario there is. This is so weird. Why would you just end so early? I guess I went down here. Oh no, is there a maze? I hope you don't actually mean maze. 
I worry you might. Oh dear. A secret chamber, okay, sure. Is... why? Why is this here? <laughs> is there more? Do I care to look? I want the keys. My key collection is incomplete. I'm a lot more interested in those than a crown, amulet, scepter, or... What's the other one? Shield. Hey, there is a key, but it's one I already had. Well, what? What is happening? <laughs> ah! I guess I'm entering the maze. No comments. I'm not picking up this gold. Don't feel like it. A stairway and more! Are you implying there's a hidden passage here somewhere? All five of those warlocks drop treasure. I'm gonna go ahead and say that warlocks are probably a major monster that always drops the scenario's assigned treasure object. Okay, yes, there was a this. Yeah, I'm a little lost, you could say. So there's a stairway there, sure. Here's... time for a break? Okay! I mean, cool. I don't think... let's see, yeah, with my hidden passage knowledge, I don't think there are any in this room other than the way I came. Right, how about here? Slots again. Anything to say? Nope. This is oh, here. Oh, okay. Really? <laughs> All right. Um I'm gonna go back up. What else might I find? Right, there were multiple other stairways and stuff. Oh, floor type um, brick. Oh right, so what do you have to say? Well, how can I help you? You jump down off your brick wall. So I didn't need to save you from that. Thanks. This screen looks very familiar. The python's in a slightly different place, though. They have my parents. Okay, it's this room. Wait, it's this room? How is it? What? I'm confused. Maybe there are some repeat rooms, but some not? Alright, no hidden passages there. Okay, I think I might be ready to just end this. <laughs> but there's... there's an onyx key to find somewhere, maybe? Somehow? I'll, I'll check these two stairways, I guess. But aren't these just gonna take me... Down to places I just saw. No, not this one. Sanctuary. This is a nice place. Search everywhere, especially underground. So I could burn these walls if I wanted. I don't. Let me search this spot. I found nothing. Alright, just a pleasant place to be. There's a stairway here. Do I know how to get to it? Probably. Hmm, not the way I thought. Oh, it's from the south! Uh-huh. It's not from the south. It's along the south edge of the room? Ok, 
Okay, so I can get through there. That's nice. Uh, okay, here we go. <laughs> what? Alright, you all just quit that. Well, okay, search everywhere, especially underground. So, like, why is this here? This is just the end of something. All right, here's a blob room. I'm going to go ahead and assume this is the end of the road, and it's just a pile of treasure for the sake of picking up treasure if you like the treasure pickup sound. Or like looking at your stats screen and seeing a number go up. Because, yeah, that's all that's here. Ah! Viewing this in the editor would... I guess it would work okay. Like, this is a perfect case for this viewer application I want to make, where I can zoom out and see all the rooms in an overview, and not have to parse through this weird little ASCII map or, you know, other less clear ways of viewing things. Okay, so there were there was a spot where there were two gray doors together. It was not here. I think it was south of here. I really wanted to open those two gray doors. These two. What are these? Oh, it's just here. Oh, okay. Well. Well. I think I'll take my victory. And I guess I'll go to the editor to find out whether I'm missing onyx and blue keys and stuff. Like, is is there even anything up there? All right, so the way, the way to victory is up through here. Well, boy is dead. There was a spike trap there. Right, okay, so I have a force field spell, so now I can actually do this. I'm just gonna take one of those goal objects and I guess be okay with it. Okay, so it's up here. Yeah, before I forget this path too much. Down there. This way, somehow. Uh, shoot, I forgot. Uh, well, clearly not there. Was it this way? Was it this way? There it is. It's south of here. Right there. All right. I'll take the crown. Sure. All right, I'm going to accept that as my victory. That was my playthrough of the Great Hall. Now, why is there so much more of it? It just... It... <laughs> ah! <laughs> no other scenario has left me feeling this confused and just like... <laughs> as if I missed a huge part of it somehow. I never found an onyx or a blue key, and why is that? I want to know. All right, so this is the main world map. Um, in the starting room here, at double quote. It does look like there are activities beyond the uh, blue doors up here. There's a room to the west? That was accidentally created, yeah. All right, so room Z was an accident, but there's definitely stuff up here implying I can somehow get... Um, time to recharge? Implying I can somehow get the blue key somewhere. Who knows where? All right, let's just trace out this little adventure. Well, but there's then there's like ladders down and stuff. There are people I could maybe talk to, and there's an onyx key there. Okay, so the onyx key is past the blue key. Expected I would find blue first, I guess. Oh, okay. It was just a little aside there. All right. Right, because there's wraparound. Okay, so can I at least find where the blue key was? 
This keeps going down. What's this place called? A dungeon, all right. Well, I won't know what these people say. Once again, I need my better scenario viewer to uh, zoom out, get an overview, see what people say. Well, maybe this can be the uh, first real use of that. See now, oh hey, there's a, there's a white door and a white key there, what? <laughs> How do I go on this adventure? Through Onyx, which I couldn't have gotten to. Was, it, was this accessible from this way? Not if you don't have the white key, which I didn't. Oh, so this clearly was not really planned out. <laughs> uh, maybe there were like, there was some plan to put together a whole key sequence and stuff, but just the rooms ended up connected up in a way the author didn't expect. And then they were just like, oh, okay, well, this scenario is good enough. Sure, it's solvable. <laughs> Job's done. What? What happened here? This is so weird. So hang on, there, there is a room here. This is, yeah, just a bunch of bats and stuff. I remember this one. I cleared it out. What's this room title? For some reason, I want to know about this room in particular. What are they guarding? What are they guarding? Is it the dungeon? Uh, it is going down. Uh, a dungeon. All right, so let's just look at the map for this floor. This will tell me basically nothing. Okay, so if I knew what ASCII character the blue key was, I could search for it in the scenario file. Another thing an external utility could do for me in theory. Right, so I wanted to see down this stairway. It's just a zap generator. Okay. Yeah, so just manually searching like this is unlikely to find me a blue key ever. Okay, well, let me just note this down as a scenario to revisit when I have a utility that let's, assuming I ever find time to work on that, <laughs> I'm barely finding time to do basic stuff. <laughs> that would be some bonus stuff that I just, oh, I, I want to though, it'd be so useful here. Ah, ah, okay, yeah, I'll note this down as a real good scenario to come back to as a demonstration of that tool. Search out the blue key, show what those people had to say, figure out if there was a more author intended route through this. But I don't know, I solved the scenario and that's going to be good enough for me. <laughs> All right, that was a confusing time in the Great Hall. See you for another one. Well, let's try something here. So I carved out a little bit of time and challenged myself to make a quick and dirty scenario viewer in not much time at all. And I spent about four hours today and put this thing together so I can zoom out and it parses a scenario and explorer graphics and I can get an overview of entire scenario and see the whole thing all at once. That's as far as I can zoom out, but that shows pretty much most of the map. It's not drawing like all the way up and down. Don't worry about that. Again, very rough and unpolished. Uh, but yeah, I can pan around here. Where's the... Uh... All right, so the initial, the starting room is right here. So let's go on a little blue key hunt. I'm going to leave it at this zoom level. Hopefully this is readable. So yes, player start location was here. It was a randomly spawned bat that attacked me right there. Um, I already tested this on this scenario a little bit and discovered that there is a way down this ladder right here to find a blue key. There was a hidden passage to the south if I didn't continue down the ladder. And I went through there and then fought some sloths and then went west and in here... Uh, right, like if I actually want to center on that... Oh, it's confusing. Right, it's very confusing. <laughs> it's drawing a 3x3, three three. no, this is the center room. Okay, right, so I... Here's the center. I went down here. I went south. Uh, you know what? Let's let's zoom in. Maybe that's less confusing. <laughs> Experimental. Don't worry about it. Okay, and there's another ladder down here. Interesting. Anyway, if I went west from here, uh, 
There's a fountain, there's a spider, there's a skeleton. I can't see what anybody says yet. It's parsing the data, like it knows what the string is, but it can't currently show me what it is. Here's a blue key. So there was a blue key in this room. So I'm gonna go back east and down this ladder to the throne room. Fascinating, okay, right. So I was here from another way, just like that. Okay, so that went around. All right, so back up on this level. Here, I'll go here so you can, well, you can't really see what I'm doing. Okay, yeah, so uh, this is the emptiness room, by the way. Uh, anyway, yeah, so you'd the, the, the idea is you'd go down this ladder, you'd go down here, see the throne room, here's the king, go back up this ladder here, uh, somehow find this hidden passage, and there's a blue key. All right, blue key there. Uh, so you take it back up above, and what can you do with a blue key? So I'm back up here. Blue key can be taken to the north. So I'd start this whole adventure. Navigate this maze like this, fight some bats. There's a wyvern there, cool. Uh, continue up here. Blue key gets me into this room again. Can't see what these people say right now, but I'll, uh, in future versions of this, I'll be able to. Won't be too hard to add, but you know, only so much time in a day. All right, so like Warlock, couple of Phantoms, Python, Sloth. There's this room with a bunch of people who talk. Boy, yeah, it would be nice if I could see uh, speech. Hmm. Okay, if I expand this tool to be able to click on somebody and see what they say before this video gets published, then I'll tack on another little bit. Uh, so yeah, you could go north here, some healing and stuff. Onyx door stops your path, but if you go down more people to talk to, and then here is the onyx key. Okay. So yeah, that's where you get the onyx key. Then you could continue to the great hall up here. And I guess just like the way that I got there from sailing south and finding these hidden passages here was like the unofficial entry. I came in the back door. Okay, yeah, and I didn't have a gray key for a while. There were at least two gray keys in this scenario though. So anyway, I would be here, I would have an onyx key, and there was another place to use an onyx key there. So I would onyx key that, I'm gonna zoom in. So I'd onyx key, you know, fight assassins and bats and stuff, go through the hidden passage, go down. Uh, there are some spiders, zap generator fountain, and nothing. What's around this room? I mean, stuff you can't get to because there's no hidden passages in the walls. Okay, so that doesn't directly help. That's just like a heal recharge station. Here, white door blocks my path. So where do I get a white key? White door blocks my path, but I've entered through the onyx here, gone on this adventure. This is how you go on this adventure, got it. Go through here, there's some spikes and stuff. You could land down there if you're not careful. But yeah, here's a white key. You get that, you can open this door and continue north to here, which you could get here with the blue key anyway. What? Okay, but this, this whole hallway is cut off by two white doors. So it's the only way to go on this adventure where there's nothing. <laughs> Four ogres and a little bit of money and some statues and some gravel. Okay, I guess that's in character for this scenario. Well, hey, now we know this is a, this was a room that was accidentally created. This is not the emptiness room. <laughs> I can see the, uh, the extra bit of mountain here. <laughs> All right, yeah, and I looked up here, and the rest of this is just the whole familiar stuff. All right, cool, yeah, so when I have this showing character speech, this is gonna be an incredibly useful tool. It's already super cool. I like it. All right, yeah, so experimental stuff. External tools coming in handy. Well, you know what? I found a few minutes during video editing that I could work on this tool a little more, and I put in some rudimentary uh, text rendering for uh, for character dialogue, so I can tab through everybody who talks in the room. Again, it's not very polished, but it does do the job. The sea at an island, so yeah, it just shows the room title first down here when I tab again. Find the crown, scepter, shield, necklace, and king. I'm also capturing this a little differently from the last clip, so it should be a whole lot sharper. So what was it in particular that I wanted to... Oh, by the way, I can see stuff like, say, the smaller has search everywhere assigned as his text, uh, which was not visible before. Boy, I really need to change this text rendering. Font's not very readable. Background's not very readable. Uh, but yeah, like this room down here, 
Pirate's Domain. Help us please. Help us please. I'm the king. <laughs> what did these maulers say? Nothing. Okay, I guess that's what it looks like when there's no text. So those didn't have text assigned. Uh, what was the place where I really wanted to see what there was to say? Die intruders. What those say? Down here? No, no. This is just the path to the... Uh, the place. So yeah, through here was where the blue key was. Uh, how was that? A key in a secret room. Okay, so that's the title of this. Then you take the key back out and unlock a blue door with it. You're up here. You're doing stuff. These skeletons say, eat my shorts. That's right. Uh, these two. I wanted to read this dialogue. What are they guarding? Oh, they say nothing. Okay, so presumably those are hostile. I don't have a marker in there for, for that yet. Water's Edge, a mountain pass, no text. A resting place, no text. Uh, so right, you come up here, you get the white key. I didn't go on this adventure, did I? Spiders say nothing. Oh, hold on, and there, this room had no title too, okay. Sloths say nothing. Down this ladder is um, a secret place, no comment. This is so cool, I love it. Wish I had this all along when I was doing this. Uh, so you go up here, time to recharge, think again, says everyone. I think I was in this room once though. No, I never had an onyx or blue key, so I couldn't have been here unless I got here from there, which I didn't. Right, these are the people. Any hidden passageways? It's in the fire pit. Look in the lower sea. Help me help us all, please. So, more specific clues for where to look for the, uh, the stuff. Treasure and a key. All right, so you get the onyx key. You come back out. A great hall starts here. Yeah, so I was supposed to go north. And yet the boat was provided to go south and the key didn't seem like it was provided to go north. So I went south instead. Uh, there was one more room full of people I wanted to see in particular. Where was it? Through another onyx door here. Hang on, so these are white doors. It wasn't those people. Oh boy, which one was it? So down on this floor, I can zoom out a little further and see if I can see what I want to see. Uh, it was, was it just those people? Maybe it was just those people. Was it farther down? Yeah, here's this weird room. Like, what's... Yeah, I never got in here. So I go down here. Here are some monsters who say, going down, no comment, no comment, no comment, no comment, no comment. What do these people say? This is a dungeon. I've been here seven years. I've been here seven years. I've been here 12 years. I've been here 12 years. <laughs> well, that's what that is. And was I ever in here? Yes, this was the, uh, that. Okay, cool. All right, so this is gonna be an incredibly valuable tool. I remember this gray key, that was the second one that I did not need. All right, love it. Uh, I'm gonna stop this before I just play around with my, my new little toy forever. Uh, I'm gonna be doing a bunch of stuff. I'll, I'll add some interpolation so you can see like which direction I'm moving through this. Yeah, I'm gonna do all sorts of stuff. This is, this is a new toy for me to tinker with. <laughs> it's great, I love it. And yeah, like anytime I need to look up a quizzer, uh, well, there aren't any quizzes in this scenario, but I, this is a quick and easy way to do it that might be a little easier than digging it out of the text file. All right, well, this is fun. I'm sure we'll be seeing this, uh, this viewer some more in the future.